Hello, everyone. We've had a couple bearish days in the market, a little bit of a slump. I'm going to give you information that you need to make informed trading choices and update you where I am and what I'm doing in my trades. So let's get right into the video so you can figure out what you need to do moving forward in the market. All right. So in my last video, I pointed out this triangle, this cone that we were in on the higher time frames. And what I was hoping for, what I was really hoping for, let's zoom right in, was that we would hold on the daily inside of this triangle, these really thick lines, and we fell out of it yesterday. We dipped pretty hard overnight. I got my stop loss down here safely out of the volatility range on the macro because I'm planning on holding. I'm planning on holding this. And if I'm wrong, I'm going to eat my words. This triangle, I believe, I believe that we got to break above this triangle. And I'll tell you why. We'll go back and take a look at the, the USDT dominance, see what's happening with the inflow of money into the market. Now, why do I believe we're going to break in back into this? I don't know. I just really want to see Bitcoin hit at least 70, 80K by the end of the year. So at the end of the day, I'm watching this daily candle to see whether we close within the tri the triangle again or if we close outside of it if we if we close approximately where we are now which i'll go i'll go back down to the 30 minute this is what it looks like we're at the level we're retesting it and it looks like we're we've crossed above on the one hour and we're coming down for some kind of a retest some kind of a retest also note this orange horizontal line that intersects at 19,167 over here. So no, just pay attention to to that and this level. This is a key level. And how this translates into the, the USDT dominance, when this chart goes up, people are pulling money into USDT. The price of Bitcoin goes down, and the price of Ethereum and all, all the other crypto assets typically goes down all in one move together. Whether this remains true in the future, this strategy of comparing the USDT dominance find it in the symbol search usdt.d the market cap usdt dominance whether this will be a long-term strategy i don't know maybe we'll see divergence over time right now this currently is a valid strategy so i highly recommend that all traders if you want to make informed choices cross-reference your trades with usdtd and possibly btcd if you want to be trading crypto or that specific coin when the market's not going to be flat when you're going to get really good volatility. So that's what seems like all of us are eagerly waiting for. So the resistance, we're running right into resistance on the USDT dominance. It fell out of a pretty intense trend line on the daily. And we've come up to retest it. And we're still closing just below it. This is the pinnacle. This is the moment that you're all waiting for. All of us are holding our breaths for, can we break? Uh, will we reject at this resistance? I'll just draw this in. It's right in that area, right at the area we're at right now. And we've got a bearish candle. If we reject here, will be great for crypto. If we, if we see more percentage points here, we're right about 7.86%, 7.85% right now. If people are starting to put in 8, 9%, into USDT, you know, the total market cap that will cause a crash down to around on Bitcoin, probably all the way down to 10,000, all the way down, down to our line 12. I got one in here. Yours may differ slightly. 12,190. That's my line. And of course, I've got, I've got limit orders placed down here just in case, just in case the worst case scenario happens. And we're, it looks pretty choppy on the weekly, it looks pretty choppy. But coming out of this trend line and looking at the dominance, I firmly am holding my convictions. And I'm not thinking emotionally. I'm thinking rationally about it. This is a very strong resistance. And yes, we've got a bullish triangle. What I know is that all this red X, it's got this wave has to hump over eventually. And I'm just imagining it curving down. And I'm imagining that coming all the way down. It's I've seen these waves a million times before. Like this. This momentum cannot be sustained. And eventually, there's got to be a change. And when that happens, you know that I'm going to have 
my order placed and you, I hope that you have your orders placed. Again, you can do with this information what you want. Traders uh, assume your own risk, of course. And so this brings me back to where we started. This dip down to this support area down here is really juicy. So the question is, can we get back into this triangle? And I'm looking for our lightning bolt. You know how powerful these signals are. I'm a believer. So I'll leave it there, guys. Comment down below if you want to see any other videos, any other strategies. If you want more scalping videos, lower time frame videos. Again, I'm making currently, I'm in a macro phase. I really want to think big picture. If you want some scalping videos, you can go check out my, uh, my other videos. I've got some really good strategies using Wolfpack Pro, the indicator on your screen. You could head over to the website, wolfpackprofessional.com. If you want to pick up the indicator, there's free trials. You can check it out. These lightning bolts, these lightning bolts are amazing. And the pink RSI is as well, telling you the exact tops. Teal is telling you the exact bottoms. It's incredible for scalping. On this teal RSI and this lightning bolt right here, if you entered right there and you exited, let's say you wanted just a short scalp on that pink RSI, easy, easy free trade, easy 1.68%. So you can check it out. If you apply leverage to that, that's free. So website's wolfpackprofessional.com. You can check it out. The website's right here. There's a reseller program. And you can head over to my Discord and ask any questions you want. I'm very responsive. And I'm working on building out this trading system. I'm adding in other components to it as well. There's another script coming out. It's going to be released. And I wish you the best in your trades.